So I recently just started the gym. I've been going for a month now and it's been going good. Um, I've been trying to go at least three days per week. It doesn't matter what days as long as I hit the three days per week mark. And I've been seeing some results. I really like it. Um, I started out not knowing how to use a lot of the gym equipment. I didn't know a lot of exercises to do, but I've been figuring it out. I've been trying different things, looking at people who are in the gym, looking, seeing what they're doing. I've been doing my TikTok search and my YouTube search to figure out what exercises to target my core, my back, stuff like that. This machine is something that I've want, been wanting to try really badly. Um, I don't know exactly what it's called, but I know you do some deep squats on this machine. And I've been wanting to do it really badly badly the first time I do it I think the bar almost fell on top of me and that's the bar without the weight like the iron bar by itself has a lot of weight to it and it's been so hard for me to lift this bar up so I'm like you know what since it's basically been a month in and I've been getting stronger let me see if I'm strong enough to pull this off so I've been taking off the weights off of it that other people had on it and I'm just going to try to do it and it was really heavy guys it was really heavy but this is the most i've done so far all right i'm back today was kind of strange i woke up late intentionally i woke up like 7 30 intentionally because i went to bed at 3 so i'm not going to wake up at 5 a.m if i went to bed at 3 or like come on now so i woke up at um yeah i woke up late and i just decided you know what i just chilled on the internet for a bit which I realize I'm really getting addicted to the internet, but that's a story for another time. Um, so I just chilled for a while until I decided to get my ass out of the house and go to the gym. And that's what I did. And I think this is the best workout I've had in a while. And it's because I stayed on it. Like today I was like, today I'm doing abs. I'm gonna get these abs right. I did like everything I've been learning over the past like month since I've been going to the gym. I just laid it all out guys all out on my apps all videos I've been watching everything like that and there's always room for improvement I can always improve my form I can always get more exercise um, more knowledge and stuff like that but it's like I'm not gonna like cram everything in my brain at once I'm going to like take things step by step and figure it out as I go which is which I think helps me but anyways I like at first I didn't want to go to the gym today but somebody said like you don't regret you don't regret a workout and they're like absolutely right because every time I think I don't want to go to the gym and I do I never regret it afterwards it's always like the best feeling being there and the feeling afterwards is like a pat on the shoulder like good job you did it and I love that feeling anyways to reward myself <laughs> I eat, I just like to spend money, which I need to stop doing. Um, I bought these two. I showed you guys in like the other day in the vlog, yeah, the vlog yesterday, that I picked up um two of these. The last time I went to the gym, I think that was Sunday. I picked up two of these, so I picked up two more. Uh, once again, the Olipop and the Poppy soda, and the, or the Pop Culture Pop soda. You know, it's funny. I call these poppies. I don't know why. It's Culture Pop soda and this is olipop soda right so i picked up the flavor orange mango lime in pop culture pop and i picked up the flavor classic root beer and i'm excited to try them I'm, i have them as my little gym treat they're not cheap guys i said that last week or we said that yesterday sorry this two, today these were like 585 for the both of them so they're not cheap and i picked up um i went to burlington and i picked up this um gloss ice curls whatever whatever because i'm thinking of doing something with my hair i'm thinking of just letting my natural curls just form um so i did i kind of did this because i'm tired of the wigs and the weaves and the sewings and the braids i'm tired of them i just want this to be out and about so i bought some gel to define the curls and um so yeah that's it i had this this um curl enhancing smooth cream for a while so i'm going to pair these two together hopefully they are a good combo 
and my curls come out popping. All right, guys, I'm done with my shower routine, or I'm just done with my shower period. I washed my hair, I applied some deep conditioner, and now I'm just letting it soak into it until I'm ready to start curling it. It's currently 5.50, 10 minutes to until 6. So I don't know if I should go and eat something. I'm not really hungry, but I just worked out, and after you work out, you're supposed to replenish the energy you lost. So I should go and eat something. Um, Hmm, I have some dishes to wash as well. Hmm. Let me go and put this video up. I'll be right back. Good morning, guys. So it's the next day and I'm doing my hair. And today I'm just using some gel and some deep conditioner to find my natural curl pattern. So I can start wearing my hair out in a little afro. I have short 4C hair. Um, I'm kind of tired of all the wigs and the weaves and the silk presses uh, whatever it is the braids i'm really over it and i just want to look like me feel like me and be me for a while i'm not saying i'm never gonna do braids and stuff like that again but right now i just want it to be a moi so it's been kind of rewarding seeing my curl pattern come out you guys can see the look on my face like i haven't seen those in a while so this is where i've reached in doing my hair department um, I still have the top left to do, but I decided, you know what, it's time for a little snack break. I mean, breakfast break, really. And I decided to pop the Olipop um, Classic Root Beer flavor. It's my first time having root beer. Mm, I don't know. I don't know how, what to compare it to because it's the first time I'm having root beer and it's this soda. So I might have to like get the original, like get the real root beer and try it with it. And for breakfast, I'm having scrambled tofu and croissants. Put the olive. So that's breaky. <laughs> Anyways, guys, that's um, basically it. I'm going to do some stretching of it because I don't like how it bunches up a lot. But I love it. I think this is the healthiest my hair has ever curled up. Yeah, I think this is the healthiest my hair has ever coiled up, so I kind of really like it. Yeah, <laughs> it's nice. Oh guys, you can have a little salon chit chat. <laughs> I feel like I'm at the hair salon right now. Um, anyways, um, so welcome back to another video. I didn't do much talking, I realized, like, this morning. Because I, I had so much to do, so much on my plate. It's currently almost, it's 12.57 right now. I'm fixing, all the, I'm taking all the eye boogers on my eye. That, that goes to show you what type of morning. I'm joking, I'm joking. I did get up, I did wash my face. Let, let's not play no games. Anyways, good morning. Or good afternoon, sorry. Mm. Anyways, I decided to do a wash and go on my hair because I want to wear my real hair out for a minute, a quick minute. I mean, I know it's cold and like it's not a good, the best idea, but I just, I'm so over the braids and the wigs and the weaves and all of it. I'm so over all of it. I just want to like look like me for a minute. I know eventually I'm going to go back, I feel like, but right now I just want to look like M-U-A. Mua! Anyways, um, I don't know, I feel kind of demotivated and stressed out by these YouTube dreams that I have, but I know I can't stop, but I kind of feel demotivated because I'm like, I'm not seeing the results I want to see, especially in the last few videos I've posted, I don't know what's not working anymore, because at the time I was seeing some results, you know, a few weeks ago, stuff like that, I was seeing some results. But no, it's just like I'm not seeing anything. So I don't know what's going on. Should I keep going? Should I stop? What's the deal? Um, I don't know. I feel like I want to keep going though. And I want to get more aggressive with it. I just want to keep going because it's my dream. And I'm, I don't want to just give up so easily. Even though it's not easy, I don't want to just give up. So, I'm going to keep going. So, prepare to see my face more. Mm -hmm. 
Okay guys, so I just took up these two cans of sodas. This one just came with the food I ate, the Coca-Cola. I don't know, we didn't order it, but it's a combo, so it just came and I drank it, of course. Um, and then this is the Olipop. I bought this in Target yesterday. And I also have the Poppy soda. The Poppy, the or Pop Culture soda? Culture Pop Culture. So I'm checking the Nutrition Facts. On these and I am flabbergasted I know that's not a word I just said it because anyways so nutrition facts let's go contains 3% juice I don't know what this I don't know this ain't no juice this ain't no juice this contains 3% juice it's at the top anyways let's go so calories 140 calories calories 35 calories can you guys see that let me turn on product showcase okay so calories, 35 calories, calories, 140 calories. All right, let's look at daily value, daily value. Total fat in the Coke, it's 0%. Total fat in the pop is 0%. 45 milligrams. Sodium, 45 milligrams, 2%. Sodium, 25 milligrams in the Olipop, 1%. Sodium, Total carbs, 39 grams, 14%. Total carbohydrates, 16 grams, 4%. Total sugar, 39 grams in my body. Guys, what did I just put in my body? Because this is, like, this is so much healthier. This is so much healthier than this, but this tastes so much better than this. And ain't that crazy? This is a classic root beer flavor. I did not enjoy this flavor at all. But I do I do like their Coke flavor though. Um and both of them are 350 355 milliliters. This is 355 milliliters total fluid ounce can. And this advertises two grams of sugar per can. This does not advertise its sugary content. So overall, I would say, if you're looking for a healthy soda, there are so many soda brands coming out now with healthy sodas. Like if you really love sodas, there are so many soda brands coming out now with things that are just a lot healthier for you. Sure, it'll take some getting used to a few of them, but your body can be trained to accept anything. Just like how your body was trained to accept a diet, to accept Coke, your body can be trained to accept better sodas so